ready? So here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Lee gets caught with that punch. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Oh, Superman punch! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Big punch land. Ooh. Spinning back fist. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, lands a left punch there, and a lot of it's set up by good footwork. Really great footwork and setting traps so that he can land that beautiful left hand. Oh, nice shot. Wow, what a head kick! Seconds to go now. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, beautifully timed with the Superman punch. That right hand hurt him a little Back bit. Back and forth we go. Oh, and there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch in the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much good. Round two straight ahead. All right, now we'll get you some highlights, DC, from that previous round. You know he's got a penchant for landing those head kicks and certainly found that form in that previous round. Very rarely do you get a fight where a guy gets kicked in the head this many times. He better make some adjustments. He better keep his hands up or he's going to go good night very soon. All right, round two is now upon us. Pretty competitive first five minutes, I thought. It's exactly what we expected. We expected when we saw this on the match sheet that these two guys were evenly matched. Let's see who really takes control as we go into the second round. Big power punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Lee gets hit by that kick to the body. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Big body kick lands. Three minutes now to go in round two. Head kick attempt. It's blocked. 
Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Teep now. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Stay strong. Still in this fight. Let's go. Come on now. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. That's a big strike right there. Oh! Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, straight right. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Nice. Checks the leg kick. Oh, nice hook there, finally. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Round three next. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, we will start to see it taking effect. All right, so another round is now underway. Pretty good action over the previous 10 minutes. Your thoughts on what we might see here? Both of the guys really picking up on the action, putting their foot in the cast, and really starting to drive it home as we approach the end of the fight, and we're still so evenly matched, and the fight has been so close to this point. Well, he continues to land a... Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Good punch. Oh, beautiful knee to the body by him there. Again, we talked off the top about his size advantage, and he put it to good use there. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Right hook to the head block. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. He's able to slip the left there. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there. Really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Big head kick land. And both guys really throwing with authority. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, blocks the shot. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Powerful leg kick lands. Great punch landed with so much power. 
clean with the right hook. Pretty good execution for him there on the sidekick, DC. Just really feeling himself. One of those traditional martial arts techniques that are making their way to the UFC's octagon. 